Earlier today, I covered information about things we have seen from the PAX event, including what people thought was rare gear, new exotics, and more. Well, I have more info today, people. More exotics, more picks of rare gear, and so forth. How's it going, guys? My name is DPJ, and I'd like to thank you for stopping by and checking out the video. If you do enjoy it, leaving a like really helps out. And if you are new around here, make sure you subscribe. Okay, so I speculated about this gear which you can see on screen now. This was taken from the PAX event and it was a part of the Black Garden gear tab. I speculated in my video earlier that this was Ray gear. I was then bombarded within the comments section saying that info was false and that this gear has been confirmed to be Vex offensive gear. So I changed the title and left an edit within the comments section. Well people, it turns out that I was in fact right the first time in thinking that this was red gear. It is, and this has been confirmed by Bungie via their post on Reddit that this was leaked on, seen on screen now. So this is in fact the new red gear. The Definity is a new raid exotic, and all those pretty cool looking weapons are raid too. The armor although we know is reskinned, it does indeed look very cool and I can tell you this because I have a couple of images of said armor which you can see on screen now. We have both the Titan Helmet and Titan Gauntlets, the actual image for the gauntlets ain't that clear but the helmet looks amazing. And these do indeed scream a Vex raid at you. The Vex offensive gear by the way Luke Smith confirmed also is what we get from the battle pass. There might be more tied exclusively to the Vex offensive activity but Luke Smith didn't mention that at all. And the battle pass gear which isn't this red gear also isn't within this tab is what Luke Smith does indeed say we can get from the Vex offensive seen on screen now. Also by the way Luke Smith states that the Vex offensive activity has only 4 legendary weapons. Here we see 7 legendary weapons. The Definity Exotic Trace Rifle. I did see a post stating that this first drops on the Vex Offensive as a legendary and we continue on a quest to make it exotic. But the source was definitely questionable in my opinion and I believe it was deleted. And the fact we also see DMG state that this is rare gear in my opinion clears this up. But hey, nothing's certain at this point as we know things can change. But either way, here is a better image of the Definity and we also see its other perk, Penance. Targets under the effects of Judgment long enough are struck with a burst of damage. Okay, so we're going to move on to an exotic I pointed out a while back and that was because within this image we can see on screen now, released by Bungie, we saw a hunter in that moon armor with that exotic helmet, the Assassin's Cow. We also see the titan in that moon gear with the phoenix cradle exotic legs. And we see a warlock in a pretty unique looking chest piece, but nothing was mentioned about this chest piece. Well, within this video, I can confirm this guy's to be an exotic. Here it is. And this is the only image we have at the moment, so apologies about the crappy quality. It's called the Storm Dancer's Brace, and its intrinsic is as follows. Ascending Amplitude. Each enemy you defeat with Storm Trance increases the damage you deal with Storm Trance. Now, I ain't really a warlock kind of guy, and in my opinion, this don't make me want use one more than what they already offer. This I don't see being anything great besides probably against low level ads and that's about it. To end the video guys we have images of three new seals coming with Shadow Keep, the Garden of Salvation, the Undying Seal and the Shadow Keep Seal. Seeing with rewards too, enlightened sounds absolutely epic. And on that note, we have come to the end of the video, people. If you enjoyed it, leaving a like really does help out. And if you are new around here, make sure you subscribe for those daily Destiny 2 videos. I just wanted to make a video just basically bringing you guys the latest information we have got out of packs, as well as clearing up what many people thought wasn't raid gear and was Rex offensive gear or vice versa. It is indeed raid gear, as far as we know now. But on that note, we have come to the end. I hope you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one. Like an animal.